With Studio Manager, you can effortlessly build projects for each client to manage all of their documents, sessions, payments, and notes all in one place. The project board allows you to see all of your projects at a glance, and you can move them towards completion to help keep your workflow organized. Let's take a look at one of these cards as an example. So here we have a project for Brett's senior photos. So here we can see an overview of payments and any outstanding balances, all of the client's details and notes, and any connected documents and sessions. So I can easily make any edits to the project, I can add in new documents, and it'll automatically be connected to this project. The project card makes it really easy to manage your client's documents and sessions in one place. So for example, I can confirm a session date. I can also record an invoice payment. I simply click on this invoice, and here I can record the payment. So I can record the payment without leaving the project card itself. This makes it easy for me to stay organized at a glance. It's very easy to create a brand new project. So if we go back to the main projects page, you can click new project. Here you can link the project to a client. You can either assign it to a new contact, or in this case, I'll use an existing client. Give the project a name, set the project type, hit create. And now we're ready to build this project out. You can also link projects while creating new documents. So let's go to the documents tab. And I'm going to create a new invoice and I'm gonna assign the client here. Now in this case, we already have a project for this particular client. So I can choose to add this invoice to the existing project, or let's say we're doing a separate project for the same client, I can create a brand new project here. Or if you prefer, you can have no project. In this case, I'm gonna create a different project for this particular client. And we're just going to call this Hazel's event, set this as an event project. And now this new invoice will automatically be linked to this brand new project card. You can also go back and link existing documents if you prefer. So let's say I have a questionnaire here and I want to link this to a project. I simply go to actions, assign to project. And now this questionnaire has been linked to the Dave and Hannah engagement project. It's very easy to customize the project areas to your liking. If you click on the settings icon next to a particular stage, you can edit the stage, change the name or the color, and hit save. You can also add in your own stages. So again, I can go to the same place and click Add Stage. You can also go to Project Settings if you want to add a brand new stage. So let's say I want to have a client review stage. This could be when a client is reviewing proofs. We can see the stage has been added. I can simply drag it here because I want to have it just between post-production and completed. And now we have this extra stage. So let's say Hazel is currently reviewing some edits or reviewing a proofing gallery. I can simply move it there. No matter how many active projects you have, your project board makes it easy to track everything you're working on. If you're done with the project and you want to make some space on the board, you can easily archive them. Simply click the archive option and this will be added to the archive tab. So here you can easily come back to it or restore it if you need to. You can see that using projects really helps to manage your various tasks for multiple clients and streamline your overall workflow. If you have any questions, reach out to our support team.